What's going on YouTube, Stacey, and welcome back to another episode on the channel. Today we have Dev Rivals Rewards from the Elite Division. I was contemplating saving them for tomorrow for Team 2 of Fuck Captain's dropping, but we're not going to do that. Because, to be honest, I think I saw a leak, and based on what I saw, the team's not as good. There's a couple good players in there, but it's not as good. So, we'll stick with this, this team that we've got. We always take the rewards that gives us the most packs available, so we've got the untradeable, two 100Ks, two 50Ks, and two two rare gold players packs, as well as our red pack from Team of the Week 27 to the current Team of the Week. Now, now, I'm slightly annoyed because I've done player with Mbappe, and I'm sure a lot of other people out there have done him as well, and he's just got an inform, which is the exact same in every single stat. So, if I get him, obviously, he'll become very, very good fodder. But I could have saved, potent well, potentially saved so much fodder, because obviously I'm going to have probably four, maybe five chances at him, because you've got Div Rivals Rewards Red Pack. I usually get three red picks from Weekend League, and I'll get a Team of the Week pack. So I'll probably get five chances at this Team of the Week in Bappy. So if I put him, it'll become fodder. If I manage to pack him in a Team of the Week pack or just a regular pack, I'll probably just sell him because he's worth like one and a half million coins, something like that. Well, he was 1.8 when I checked last night, but he was like fresh out. So he might have dropped to that. I've not checked since. Don't quote me on that price, guys. But let's get into this red pack and see if we get a Neymar from last week. Would still be nice. No, but we do get Koke. So we'll take Koke because you want fodder. It would be very nice to see his fuck captain's guard to come out. But let's head on over to the store and get these packs open, guys. Right, guys, here we are at the store. And we're just going to wait these five seconds for the preview pack to refresh. We'll open that and then we'll get into the Dev Rivals rewards. So, preview pack, let's see. Come on. Fuck captain's card. Fuck captain's card. Come on, EA. No, nothing. Not even a board. Well, not even a, a flare. I'm so used to calling them boards, but obviously every single pack is a board now. So, let's just get into these packs. We'll just work our way up like we always do. Two rare gold players packs first. Come on, anything? Anything? Oh, Team of the Week French. Oh. No, it's that guy whose name I can't pronounce. Is it Zobisly? Is that how you pronounce it? I don't know. 84 rated Team of the Week, though. That's that's good. Good fodder. Good for SPCs. Because I'm thinking about doing the moments icon pack. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm thinking about it. And I'm not... I don't know if it's really going to be worth that, but I kind of want to do it because it's content. It'll be quite fun to open. Whether we actually get around to doing it, though, I, I don't know, because it's coming around 700k, is it? I'm pretty sure it's around 700k. I've potentially got the stuff to do it, but it'll take a while. I might have to buy a little walk out. Who have we got? Brazilian. Cedar. See if it would be Neymar. This time round, I would have been... Fuming because he was literally in Team of the Week like yesterday, but that's decent. Another walker who could potentially go into this icon SPC that we're, we're just talking about there. Have you guys done that icon moments pack? If you have, leave in the comments down below who you guys have got from and if you thought it was worth it. But anyway, moving on, rare players pack number two. Come on. Oh, oh, fuck, Captain, who is it? Spanish, Cam, on the nine. He doesn't look like the nine, does he? That, that's okay. That, that's, he, he looks like a good card. He looks like a very good card. So if you, 97 agility and 98 balance. With 94 acceleration, 88 sprint speed's a wee bit low. 88 stands not great, but obviously we've just got Fernandinho as well, who's only got 85, and he lasts the whole game. So Munayim could be pretty good as well. But he looks like a very, very good card. What does he sell for? I'm going to guess not a lot. Between 40 and 50k by the looks of it. You know what? That's more than most cards sell for. Most cards actually go for like, what? 30k. Especially the lower rated ones. But that's a decent pull. Another thing we've actually got to potentially do is the campaign party bag. And it actually looks pretty decent this time round. Because what is it? You can get a future stars from team one or two, a fuck birthday from team one or two, or a team one 
from for captains. Now, personally, I think that's actually pretty good. It's only a pick of two players, but I think that's good promos to do it from. You know, it's not like ancient dead ones that you're just going to do nothing with. There is potential of getting a very, very good player out of that, and we're potentially going to be doing that as well. Now, obviously, that will also eat up quite a bit of work because it's an 85 rated with a team of the week. Obviously, doing that takes away from doing the icon and vice versa and all this kind of stuff. But it's something, I mean, we've got coins. It's not really the end of the world. If I need to buy high rated players, I'll do it. But anyway, let's crack on with these rewards. Jumbo Rare Players Pack number one. Come on, an alpha captain. An alpha captain. No, but we do get a walkout. So, trend. 87 rated, it's not bad again. We're going to keep... Oh, Muller as well, 287s. We're going to keep circling back to this, just getting further. And nothing else in the duplicates, which is okay, because most of my club is actually untradeable. So it's getting to the stage where I can't do anything with my duplicates unless I recycle them in an SBC. But this is the final pack of the Devrival Rewards. This is the final pack that I have before... Team 2 drops tomorrow of fuck captains. Today when you're seeing this, probably. Let's rip it open. Hope for one last fuck captain. Come on, EA. Are you going to bless us? Are you going to bless us, EA? No. We get a big walkout, though, don't you dare. Oh, I thought it was going to be. Every time I see the Brazilian walkout, I'm thinking that's going to be Neymar, really. But we get Ederson, another good high-rated player for any SPCs we do. Is there anyone else? No, but we do get another Team of the Week. So, that is it for today's rewards, guys. Leave it down in the comments below what you guys got from your rewards. If you maybe managed to pull that red and bappy from your elite rival rewards, if you're in the elite division. But yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you guys got. So, guys, as a quick wee bonus, we've decided to just go and do the campaign bag player pick now. But, we've also got, in our packs, an 85+. plus which I forgot I had. So we're going to do both of these picks right now. Let's see if we can get another fuck captain card out. Oh, we get one. Oh, it's Hector. Oh. He's not the best. So surely we've got to go for Sterling for rating here. But Hector's obviously promo. I mean, we don't upgrade or anything, so is it really worth that? Rating? To be fair, 87. It's not... A huge difference, an 88 and an 87. Do you know what? I'm going to go for Hector because you won't be able to pack him again. I know that was probably the wrong decision, but it's what we've done. Watch as we get him now out of this player pick for the campaign bag, which, as I said earlier, is from um, Team 1 and 2 of Future Stars and of For Birthday, as well as Team 1 of Fuck Captains. But let's see who we're going to get. Come on, you. Oh, Cookie! Daka looks so good as well, though. Oh, I think... I think it's going to have to look at those stats. I don't think I can say no to Cookie. 91 rated as well. Saying that, Daka looks... I've got enough forwards, you know. We're going to go for Cookie, so we've got two more fuck captain cards. Unfortunately, none of the big boys. We didn't get any of the hero ones. We didn't get Ben Yedder. We didn't get Royce. We didn't even get Luis, you know. Like, a goalkeeper. You always get goalkeepers in promos. But that is it for today's video, guys. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys have got from your campaign bag, what you guys got from your 85 pluses, your rewards. And, yeah, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. As I said, the channel going. I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.